Good morning, it's Vlogmas Day 14. We're getting through the month, aren't we? I'm just arriving at work and it's another cold day. So my husband parked, so my husband parks the car so close and I have to squeeze in through and it's impossible because this table is here. I have to put that downstairs. And boy, that was really tough. Well, now that I'm in pajamas and ready to enjoy the rest of my evening, I decided to answer a question that lovely kid, a daily vlogger from Japan, in Hokkaido, Japan, um, she asked if why I didn't iron after I was finished washing my clothes. Well, it's because I actually use a fi fabric press. So I want to show you that. Here is our fabric press. Let me step back so you can really see it. So this is a Conair fabric press and it's what I use to iron my clothes. So I use this because I actually am kind of fearful of using an iron. So there you go. I already have it heated up. So I'll show you the top, the controls. Most everything is you know, nylon, but there's other settings. That's the lowest setting is nylon. And what you do is in between those two plates is you put the clothes and you press it until the alarm goes off and then you lift it back up. I'll demonstrate. It was pretty quick. And it does a pretty good job, if you can see. I, I folded yesterday, and it's wrinkly. I would definitely want to press this before I go to work in it, because I like to wear these on Friday, because they're super fun with all the glitter. Look how straight that is. There you go. Freshly pressed. I hope you enough. like that little demonstration of my fabric press. Um, I'm sure you saw the model number on there. I can't think of it what, it what it is right now. I'm in the kitchen and I am gonna get ready to try and dream up some kind of dinner because I did not plan it. <laughs> I probably should have. But I've got some ground beef and I've got some ground pork so I'm gonna try meatballs and marinara. So wish me luck. I have added half a cup of Italian breadcrumbs, um, a pound of Italian, uh, spicy Italian ground pork and underneath all that is some 80-20 beef and one egg which I'm going to rethink I think I might need to get two eggs so I will put another egg but I'll do that off camera and now I'm going to make my meatballs
So after I use the, uh, this is the marinara sauce that I'm using for totally. But after I pour it in there, there's usually some in the bottom that I can't really get out. But that's okay, I'm going to use it. Put it here. <laughs> I fill it up with water. And then I boil my dry pasta in it. Perfect Miss Chloe Bell is being stubborn and does not want to eat her food. Coco, go eat! Eat! Nope. She's She's gonna go and check to see if I dropped anything when I was making meatballs. Mm-hmm. No, sorry, puppy. Mama did not drop anything for you. She's like a little hoover. She goes. Just sniffing. Maybe she can find a little treat. Mm -hmm. Always checks by the stove. Nope. Come on, Clo Clo. Let's eat your food. Eat your food. Eat. She said, nope. Not good enough. <laughs> She's going to try and cover it up again. I just know it. She's so funny. Well, now we'll get settled and we'll watch some TV. I hope you enjoyed your day. Until tomorrow, and thanks for watching. Take care. Bye.